What is going on ladies and gentlemen, my name is Ecoli Espresso and welcome back to another Black Ops 3 video here today on the channel. Today, a lot of people yesterday were talking about the best ways to rank up in Black Ops 3, the beta right now, and if you guys are watching this a little bit later, well, it definitely can work out there as well. So today we're going to be taking a look at and going a little more in depth than a lot of people did cover yesterday. We're going to be taking a look at three main things here to rank you up fast in the Black Ops 3 beta. Now the first thing is the level system currently is very elongated. Most likely it will be changed for the full game. But it could possibly still be the same thing in an elongated form. What I mean by that is that it does take quite some time to rank up. A lot of people are not hitting max level even now after grinding a full day into the game itself. Only level 28 is the max level. Normally that wouldn't take too long, but right now it is quite tough to rank up. They wanted to keep this beta fresh for everybody and not let everybody burn out real quick after they reach max level. So there's new stuff to be found out about every single time you play the game. So how do you get there as as fast as possible. I know a lot of people want to take full advantage, get as much gameplay as they can in here while they get the beta available to them before it moves away off of PlayStation 4 and into the Xbox One and PC beta. The first big thing is that I know a lot of people definitely will have told you already, Hardpoint is definitely a game mode to play. That's one of two we're going to be talking about here today, but Hardpoint, you can really farm XP off of this. What you do is you go in, jump on the Hardpoint, back out, let the enemies come on the Hardpoint so they capture it, then you take the kills and jump on and repeat the whole process again. Really, that in itself is a great way to farm XP and get some quick XP there, but the real thing comes in with all the action. A lot of the times, yes, you are going to need to play objectively. That does help out tremendously in terms of going for that ranking up. Doesn't really necessarily help gameplay sometimes because you'll get a lot of deaths, but it definitely will help you rank up fast. Now, the next big thing here is kill confirmed. This one is a hidden gem, something that really helped a lot of people rank up previously, but still is under the the radar for the most part from a lot of people's perspective on what they want to play to rank up. Now the big thing with this is the fact that every time you get a kill it's 50 points. Yes, 25 points for a denied kill, but here's the big kicker. It's 100 points for a confirmed kill at this point in time. Right now that is just a tremendous amount of points right there. If you're in the vicinity of a lot of players, you can get 150 points for every single kill that you get off theoretically. So that definitely does help out and the way that it actually makes you play objective Objectively, it helps out as well because you want to keep going for more and more tags. So as for game modes to play, definitely those two and go for the objective. That's the big thing here with that if you do want to rank up. Now, probably one of the most hidden gems here that a lot of people have not talked about and one that I honestly find is so easy to do and such easy XP is to use different weapons here within the beta. If you guys did not know, there is weapon levels here to Black Ops 3. Every single weapon it can go up to, I think it's 15 as the max level. Once you get that, then you can't actually rank up anymore. You'll be able to prestige them later on, but as it stands right now, every single time that you rank up that weapon, you get bonus XP. As you guys know, earlier rounds are a lot easier to rank up. Once you get up into those higher levels, that's when it does become a little bit more difficult, where you have to play a little bit more with them, but once you do, it still helps out tremendously. So the way that it goes is sequentially. You start off at level one, level two, you get 100 points. Level three, you'll get 200. Level four, you'll get 300. Level Level five, you'll get 400. Level six, you'll get 500. So on and so forth, all the way up to things like level 13, you'll get 1,200 XP. So for every time you level up, the number that's below that, you'll get the denomination for that in itself. So it's free XP just for using weapons. And if you do have a lot of time on your hands, or maybe not even a lot, that is, you can still use a bunch of different weapons and get free XP just by getting kills with the weapon itself. Definitely, no matter what you look at it as, it is some easy XP here and something very quick you get just for playing the game and getting some kills with your weapon. So that's going to wrap up the video here today, ladies and gentlemen. I wanted to give you guys a couple more ways to rank up fast here within the beta. PlayStation 4 players, you guys may already be at that max level, but for you guys on Xbox and PC, keep an eye out on this and maybe even use this to your advantage here. It's something that I think can definitely help you out to grind out those final levels here in the beta. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you did like the video, be sure to like writing down below. Any shares to your Facebook, Twitter, and or MySpace if you're a that I always greatly appreciate it. If you're here, be sure to subscribe for the best of quality Black Ops 3 content and new news information. You guys know exactly to find it right on my channel. Thank you guys once again so much for watching. My name is Nicolai Espresso. I will see you guys tomorrow. Take care and peace.